Hello and welcome back to Oscar Modeling's part four of the Russian Navy Varieg build. One three three fifty scale kit by Trumpeter. And in this part, uh, we're putting together the um, barrels for the missile launches that go on the deck. And it's all coming along really well. Um, what I've done is I've join the two halves together and and glued them and then then I've cleaned them up afterwards to remove the seam lines and any sprue that was on them and then the covers that go on the front just glued those on and that's it basically now I've just finished the eight of those which will all mount onto these platforms here that go on the deck and they simply just sit in there like that so but what I'm going to do because I really want to paint these properly is I'll paint these separately before I put them on so they, there's full coverage all the way around them because that you know it'll be a little bit tricky getting in underneath so paint those um, separately also um, there's some photo etch for these so we got little photo etch bits here and they were quite simple to uh, bend there's only three little spots to bend on those and they will sit on the top here they just mount on there so they'll go in place before I paint these um yeah so that's coming along well um the hull that we did in the previous video you would have seen that it's all painted up the um, waterline marks on there completely finished now it's all dried put that in a clear plastic bag to protect it from any dust or anything and i put that away because that's not going to come back out until the last step when the, so the last step of the instructions is actually to attach the hull Okay, so on the instructions where we're at now, uh, so the photo etch bits are done, which are here. Uh, these are put together with the hatches on the front. Uh, I'm just going to put the photo etch on, onto these, and then we'll paint all this up uh, before I glue down these. And then moving on to another bit of, uh, looks like a small superstructure bits there and then of course over the page we uh we got a lot there's a lot of bits and pieces on that all right now i don't remember if i showed or not that the yeah i did i showed the superstructures that i have painted is all completely done in in the uh there we go it's all um, undercoated, and yep, yeah, that's all undercoated. So, because there's going to be the orangey red colours for the decks on top of that, I'll be spraying that next, and then letting that dry so I can tape that over, mask it all off, and then do the final grey everywhere else it's supposed to be okay now as for the um, spraying the deck which is already undercoated um, I've been looking at the plans here or our painting guide and the way this is most of the deck majority of the deck is black a lot of the orange sections are actually on the top of structures not actually the deck other than this center area here um, yeah so this area here has some deck that needs to be orange and underneath where all these um, missile tubes are will also be orange so the way I'm going to go about this is I'm pretty much going to um, I'll paint all the black first 
so we'll get uh probably mask that off a little bit but it's no big deal it's mainly i'm going to mask over the black when i put on the orange so i'll do all the black areas of the deck which is actually going to be i'm going to try this new color here which is a mr hobby um metal black which i think is going to look good so we'll do all that black on the deck first and then after that's dried off i'll mask off the areas which will only be a certain section of it so we don't get overspray and do the uh, other orange color which i've made up a special mix here all right so i'll get on to this uh finishing off these first and then uh see how we go with the rest we'll come back and have a look at the progress okay back shortly okay so i've um put all the photo etch on these on these here and uh they're all sitting there nicely and uh it was a bit tricky getting to be to get them on there straight but come up okay so no problem now these with the barrels um, or the tubes um, I'm just going to put these aside for a while because we're only on page 9 and it's not till page 14 that these actually get fitted onto the ship and in the meantime we're the next steps are building quite a bit of superstructure which will be needed to be undercoated and painted all pretty much the same color as these so what I'll do is I'll, I'll label this as page 9 and I'll add that to the containers and um, we'll come back to that when they when we've got a few more pieces built up that need to be painted similar colors not that I don't mind getting the airbrush set up and and painting them which I am I pretty much only takes a few seconds but you know the more pieces we got to do um, at, in the one session it makes things a little bit easier because everything's gonna dry at the same time and uh, everything can be continued on working with at the same time all right so those will will set aside and now i know i'm avoiding the deck i'm a little bit nervous about the deck uh so i keep going back to building up more superstructure pieces which really it's going to come to a point where it's going to ask me to put these things on the deck which i won't be able to do because i haven't painted it yet so I'm thinking, you know what, put that aside, I'm going to paint, I need to paint, so I will look at starting to paint some pieces, alright, so back in a sec. <laughs> okay, welcome back, so I finally got some paint on the deck, so I'm just going by the colour here, just so you get an idea of what we're trying to match here with this colour and the result was grab one of them here there's one that's come up pretty good so this area around here is going to be all the deck red color um, then the other part of the deck here so this area here is going to be the red we got a little bit coming on to here it'll be red and the center here leading up where the helicopter comes out of the hangar bay area that'll be red um, i'll be taping off all of that red outside that on that um, because the rest of it will be black i've also got uh, the top of the superstructure here red so the walkway around that which will be red and then i'll tape off that red when it's dry and we'll do the gray and then of course all this area here that's going to be red and again tops of some of those may be gray so i'll tape them up and it's come up really nice the color it's exactly how i wanted it to be um, the sides of this along here i've done them red just the tops they'll, they'll go on the side there and again they've come up really nice and of course the top of the bridge area is also red 
and there it is there. Okay. So um, if I'll just re-sort myself out here, we'll come back and have a look at what I'm working on at the moment. So this here is the um, superstructure in the center of the ship that in that is the um, the funnel area for the smokestack. And now let me just bring the camera down a bit so we can see a bit closer closer. Okay, so now um, the tricky part with this is that the in this is the smokestack here and it's divided into two sections. Now so um, this is divided into two sections in half here, but the inside of here has to be painted black because it's inside the smokestack. This here goes inside there like this it sits inside, which will also have to be painted black. So I'll do that before I glue it all in. Um, now this part goes on here will sit in here this will be the deck orange color so I'll be spraying that before I put that on and then um, there's a couple of more pieces I have to take off the instructions here we'll get to that um, there will also have to be painted black before they're fitted in there as well now, a little bit fiddly um, but I'll get all the pieces all ready at least set to put uh, a primer coat on them and then get these bits black, which will be, um, I think I have some NATO black. So it's a, it's not quite as a bright, deep black. So it looks more like a, a soot color, I guess. Um, so that will all look fine deep down in there. I'm surprised by it, actually the amount of detail on that that's going to be sitting down in there like that. Because you're not going to see it. Well, you you will, I guess. I guess you will see it. But again, it's all going to be black in there. Okay, so um, I'll continue with this and the other little extra bits onto it. And um, again, progress a bit further. I'll be back shortly. Okay, welcome back again. So here's my uh, jigsaw puzzle of uh, the funnel um, structure. So there were a few little bits of photo edge platforms that had to be put on to some of the sides of these. Um, there was one piece that was a triangular, or this sort of shape that I had to glue together that left a bit of a seam line on the back. So rather than uh, cover it up, I created a drain pipe. So that's, instead of having to get out the uh, filler and everything, I put a drain pipe down there and then on the top I put a railing there's a couple of railings up on top and uh, there's some clear parts that were there for the platforms there so that's all good and then at the back of the um, smokestack uh, I put in a couple of doors that weren't there that putting on there and the railings up the top um, put those where the ladders come through onto those platforms. So we don't want people falling off. I'll go and have a look at how the um, orange decking is that we did earlier. Get the focus there. And, uh, geez, it doesn't like focusing, does it? There we go. Yeah. Yeah, so we'll come back and, and have a look at... Um, what I need, pretty much what I'm going to have to tape up before I spray the black on the deck. That might be the next thing. Okay, so back shortly. Okay, hello, welcome back. Unfortunately, I lost uh, a bit of video footage of um, what, what I was doing. Somehow I left it recording for 15 hours and I came back to it and when I tried to bring it up it wouldn't so fortunately I had to delete it so basically what I've done is and I'll 
will update where I'm at is I've painted all the funnel areas so all the insides of the funnel are all done in their NATO black the outsides are all in the final base coat of grey this will be the inside go inside the funnel there probably that way so that'll sit inside there it's all painted up also painted is this needs to go down the center of the, pun the funnel but that needs to be painted the orange deck color these two on the sides will go in if it's the inside there so they're painted basically it's all done um, including the, this piece which sits on the back like this uh, that'll sit in there like that of course the other side is the black so that's looking good too um, just move that oh, I think I nearly bumped a railing then but oh, it's okay I've also taped up all this which would have been in my video that I footage that I deleted was actually showing this all being taped up but uh, so I've taped it and then painted it so this is all finished now I had just one problem as you can see there it lifted the paint yeah so I'm gonna have to touch that up not not a biggie and another one little spot there where it's touched the paint lifted the paint another touch up point the other two point spots you can see there on top of what's going to be painted anyway uh the gray all this is done you might see the windows glinting look at that beautiful so i've taken all the tape off them and then all the windows are you can see that yep and of course the bridge area at the top there's all completely done as well uh all up in here that glass doesn't want to shine for some reason but anyway um, also these sections that go down the side of the structure here done with the color on the top of them it's all done and the top of the bridge which sits up on top uh, that's done as well and all been masked so again very happy with all the way that came out uh, pyramid piece that's all done as well put that aside uh, right now while all that was drying uh, I started on the next section uh, which is just to the rear of the helicopter pad um, there's a structure there which includes the um, the hangar so if I slide this through I don't have a closer look so this is the hangar where the doors will be on there um, it's going to go on like that so that'll be there um, so that's all been put together a clear piece in the back again because there's a couple of uh, more windows that need to be taped to be able to see through um, the top of the hangar needs to be painted well, all these need to be undercoated, but the top of that hanger will be the deck orange. Uh, we've got the crane built there. We've also got this complex looking radar, which goes to the top of the ship. Get a look at that. It's looking really good. Um, so that's all done and ready to be painted. I almost made, well, I did make a mistake. I actually put this on the wrong way around. And then I had a quick look at the instructions and realized, oh, it's the wrong way. So, I mean, I had to take it back off. Lucky there was no damage or anything. And I just changed it to the right way around. So that's done. Now I'm building a section that comes off underneath here, um, which is this part here, which will have more windows. That's why there's more clear parts to it. And then there's a deck area on top of that which again will be painted the orange um, so yeah it's it's progressing quite well I um, I'm going off the paint uh, guide here but also from the footage of the real ship as well to fix any of the corrections and errors that I've come across um, so here they've got uh, 
pretty shortly when I have to put all this structure together, uh, putting it on the deck. But I haven't put the deck onto the ship yet, so that's all separate. So I'm holding off on doing that as long as I can because we're getting to part where all the other structures are starting to go down. The deck itself isn't complete yet because I mean, even after all that's gone on, we've still got the helicopter pads to go on and bits and pieces. Um, the deck is still... I'm going to bring that out. Actually, we'll bring that out now and have a quick look at it. Okay, I'll just tidy up a bit here. Okay, so here's our two sections of the deck. Now the we'll have a look at the front first. So all the orangey red deck area is covered. That's I want to stay that color. This section here has to be done the black, which will be our metal black. But the splinter shield that goes around this gun here is going to be grey which is why you see it painted grey at the moment what I'll do is this was done yesterday so now I'll be able to tape that up before I spray everything black all the little bits and pieces here on the deck I'm going to hand paint them grey again because it's just too small and too hard to be taping that up so that'll be the job that'll be done today is tape that up and do that deck area black on the rear of the ship here where the helicopter pad will be down here this is where that hangar deck you saw earlier on building will go over and the section below it so all the taped up areas of the spots i want to keep um, the orange color is covered everything else will be black except the gray so i've done the gray in here um, I've got some pieces that cover here and in the earlier video um, I did the piping and stuff and added some detail to those pieces they're still on the side but all this here is going to be gray on the inside so I had to I need to tape that up this the top of this and this and this will stay gray I'll tape them I'll tape these two up and then we'll give it all a coat of black because all that will be black um, everywhere else the same on the other side, that wall in there, so got to keep that grey. Um, so might get that done today too. Um, so that's it. That's as far as we'll go with this video, part four. Um, part five will be um, putting together a lot of these bits of structure that have already been painted up. Also, we'll come back and have a look at the missile launches, which I've undercoated and I'm just going to put on a base coat today so we'll have a look at that in the next video part five so please thanks for watching please comment below if you've got any comments uh, give us a thumbs up if you like the video subscribe if you haven't already hit that notifications bell so you get notified of the videos as they come up and get released and um, hopefully look forward to seeing you and um, showing you part five of the russian navy varyag I'm still pronouncing that right, I'm sure, uh, by Trumpeter. Okay, cheers, see you soon.